Once we understand that everything we think we have doesn't actually belong to us at all, but rather to God, we can begin to see ourselves simply as stewards or managers of the resources that God has entrusted to us. And that's what it boils down to when it comes to living a life lived shrewdly and allocating God's resources in a God-pleasing way. And that takes intentionality. Because a manager certainly can't do their job without a plan. Imagine creating a personal spending plan, a budget, and every category that you created came with a little prayer as you did it. Not just the category for giving to church, like, God, please use this gift to spread your love all across our city. But even those more earthly categories, like transportation, home costs, fun money. We do it for food, right? Come, Lord Jesus, be our guest, and let these gifts to us be blessed. Imagine if, when we budgeted a certain percentage of our income to something like our cell phone bill, we prayed, let this gift to us be blessed. Even vacation, personal care items, car maintenance, let these gifts to us be blessed. Because they're all gifts from God. And a gift is always just a little bit harder to throw away, isn't it? Brothers and sisters in Christ, may we do this lovingly. It's not just an action that can be done without thought. Jesus even said, God knows your hearts. What is highly valued among men is detestable in God's sight. But rather, let us act with as much intention as Jesus did. So our challenge is this. Arrange a God-pleasing plan. Pray for strength to manage with intention. And live the life God created just for you. A God-lived life. A life lived shrewdly.